Halloween, this is Squirrel Stampede back playing some Halloween Tycoon 2 today. Uh, for the festive uh, candy season we are in, today we are going to build a Halloween Tycoon. There is Ben Ultra hopping by. He has already begun his Tycoon somewhere on this map. We are kind of in the center of town right now. Uh, over there is a factory, a pumpkin factory. And I'm not sure whose that is, but I'm going to go and build my pumpkin factory. So I'm excited. I just have to find it. There's another one along with us today. Also out there, Amigo James is over there. You can see him. He's dancing on his house. He always implements the dance. Look at him way over there. Can we zoom in? There he is dancing in ultra high def. Look at that. That is beautiful. You can't even like... I mean, that's Hollywood grade right there, so keep dancing, James, keep dancing. And also joining us today, Udger is here. Udger is a, a cherished family member who has known pumpkin squishing beyond anyone's beliefs, whatever that means, I don't know. <laughs> so uh, I'm gonna go over here to my area uh, and check this out, uh, start up my pumpkin factory. A little bit of a walking while I'm walking. Don't forget to give us a squirrel eye and a squake and a squament. Please help us out. Always appreciate everybody joining in. Lots of fun to be had, especially as we head towards Thanksgiving and Christmas. Touch to claim. All right. Um, I don't know how to how to do that yet. Um, oh, it says Landry Squirrels Tycoon. So I have officially opened my business. I have zero dollars. I have scary spiders up there on the mountain. I've got to run over here and start my tycoon. The more I, I waste time talking, the less we are going to be, be be able to build in this video. Begin working, zero dollars. And is everyone ready? And I'm gonna hop onto the button and I've built my first pumpkin thing. What is that thing? Can I look into it? Oh, I'm on a conveyor belt. Ah, run, run, run. Run, Landry, run. Run, run, run. Whoop. Okay, let's zoom out a little bit so we can see a little better. Look at that. It's dropping pumpkins. So, buy pumpkin dropper for $50. I don't have $50 yet. I have no money. All I have is this pumpkin dropper, uh, which drops pumpkins on my head if you time it just right. So, over here. Now we have to take another very long walk over here. <sighs> Um, luckily, as this game progresses, they make the distance between there and here a little easier. Oh, a hundred and ten dollars! Oh, a hundred and thirty! Look at that! Uh, where do I go for that? Um, oh, right there. There we go. A hundred and fifty dollars to spend on my pumpkin machine over there. Way over there. Uh, let's get another twenty and then we'll run on back. Running on back. Here we are. Oh, this is exciting. Here I am running towards you. Uh, towards you we are running. And okay, so. Um, buy pumpkin dropper. Alright, now I've got two pumpkin droppers. Now we're going. The factory's moving. And do I have just enough money to... No, I don't have enough money to buy the, the third pumpkin dropper. But I can buy the wall. The first wall. So let's build a wall. That way I don't feel so like... Like out in the open. I don't want people to like see my project, my my factory, and steal my secrets. I don't want that. So here we go. We're gonna go over here, and then I think we'll go squeak on over to Amigo James's because he's been building for a while. And is he still dancing over there? I think he might still be dancing over there. I see something going on. I gotta ask him. Okay, so 380. I'm gonna grab that and build a little more. There's my third pumpkin dropper for $150. And I have 300 to spend on another pumpkin dropper. Look at that, four of them. And back to the money machine. There's a lot of running back and forth with this game. I can see that now. Oh, what what would you say? Ten ten dollars a second right now, about. So that's something. That's something to be proud of in my new endeavor of Halloween tycoon pumpkin making by second wall. We've got to buy a second wall. I like that idea. And oh, there's Ben Ultra is stopping by. Ben Ultra twenty one is stopping by. I'm sure his factory is going really well. How's your factory going, Ben? It's going good. So that's great! <laughs> uh, 500. Oh, I don't have enough money for it. 
Well, let's go run over to Amigo James. Come on, Ben Ultra. Let's run over to Amigo James's lot and see what he has got going. It's going to be a long, long and dangerous run. I'll just grab some of the money before we head out. 690. So come on, Unger. Come on this way. Come on this way. Come on. He doesn't hear us. He's been dancing up here for at least 30 minutes straight. Um, he's got to be incredibly tired. There he goes. He's just all ready for us. High definition, Amigo James dancing. And uh, what do we got? So here's the front of his factory, or his tycoon. And whoa, so look at that. Look what's going on here. Oh, oh, ah, he's got a sword. Someone just got hurt there, but um, yeah, he was, he was attacking Ben Ultra. He's got a sword. How do you get a sword? But you can see now, look at the conveyor belt system. This makes it much faster uh, to go from place to place. Who turned out the lights? Oh, there's pumpkins everywhere here. Uh, oh, and this is making candy over here. Look at that. These are candy machines, maybe. So very interesting. So lots to build soon. And I, oh, he built his roof. That's why the light, light went down. He built a roof to his, his tycoon. So those are some things we will see in our near future very excited to see and so I've got to race back as fast as I can build a little bit and then we'll take like a 20 minute time out to enhance the future of the future pretty neat little area though this is Halloween Tycoon 2 there's also Halloween Tycoon 1 there was a great debate over which one we should play and I think we just decided with the second because it is the most uh, newest so you know you go with the new and those spiders up there are really creeping me out. Uh, there's Ben Ultra, he's running. We are getting a ton of exercise. This game totally needs skateboards. Uh, I'm gonna guess 600, no, more like 800 and $26. I'm gonna guess $826. We'll see how close I am to that. You can see I still don't have a front wall to my factory, but it's getting there. We're making some things. So what was it? Whoa, I was way off. Two thousand, three thousand and twenty dollars. So now let's get building. Let's build some fun over here. This is perfect. So it's always good to kind of do a little exploration in games like this because it gives you time to gain some money. So we're going to work more on the pumpkin droppers than we are anything. So there is another one. Looking good and a conveyor Ooh, this one's expensive 2500 uh, but it's worth it because now i can get over and back really fast uh 10k for another conveyor Ooh, and 25 oh i don't have that but i could build some walls there's a wall there's a wall and uh, buy some windows i can't afford those so let's take like a 20 minute a little uh, nap and we will uh, venture back to see where we are in just a little bit so hang on for a second here okay so much has happened in just a few minutes here we are look at this on top of our wall and all the factory is a glowing uh, making a ton of pumpkins and candy uh, there's lazy kitty lazy kitty is here on the stairs jumping up and down she's excited Oh, so much to share. What do we share first? Well, we are certainly making a lot more money now and a couple different reasons. Uh, look at that. That's a huge chunk of money right there to bring in. Uh, obviously, all these candy droppers and all these conveyor belts are doing it. Oh, I think that was my last candy dropper for the moment. I've got three conveyor belts of candy droppers. Look at that. So let's ride the, the uh, conveyor belt in. Look at all the candy droppers. And we are going in and now we are headed towards the pumpkin droppers. I hope one doesn't hit me on the head. And then we go on over into here. Uh, so yeah, a t Whoa. <laughs> run, run, I can't get out, I can't get out. Um, a lot going. Also, Lazy Kitty uh, suggested we pick up this for 100 Roblox. You get this cool little um, extra bonus dollar dropper. And that certainly helped speed things up. That seems like a good deal. Only 100 uh, wasn't that bad, so I totally totally pick that up so uh, what else do we got to do uh, everyone's been telling me about this sword so let's see I bought a sword 
And where is my sword? I uh, picked it up, but I don't see it yet. And then there's also a gravity coil. Oh, they're right there. Okay, I see where they appeared. Um, and let's get this upgrader out of the way if I can. The upgraders, I believe, uh, produce a lot more money for your factory. Uh, so let's let's check out this sword real quick. Okay, I've got a sword now. Oh, we are gonna have to duel in a little bit with these. And oh, there's uh, now I've got the coil. What does the coil do? Uh, I think the coil doesn't it. Oh, we jump really high. <laughs> Woo! What, which is pretty neat because you can see now the candy in the buckets better. I think I see sweet tarts. I think I see like Skittles, maybe like berry Skittles. Um, maybe some Tootsie Rolls? Yeah, it's a little fuzzy star Starburst maybe in there, so a few different things. Oh, Amigo James is on the other tower, that's funny, I didn't even see him there uh, until just now. There he goes, jumping high, that's funny. Okay, so, oh my goodness, is that 170,000? Whoa, that's a lot of money. Oh, and this is kind of cool, I've got security doors now, so you can come in. And if I'm like, I don't want anybody inside my factory, well, I just get to this button here, if I can get to this button, and I can turn them red. And now no one but me can come inside my uh, my place of business. Of course, I, I need a roof to, <laughs> need a roof to uh, really protect my business. So maybe I can do that too right now. I'm, I'm running out of things to purchase. Over here, what do we got here? Buy, soffit. So, oh, we've got a ceiling and lights. Look at that. Now we are a total awesome factory. Oh, that is cool. That is so cool. It's like bright in here. What is next to behold? Buy Halloween decorations. We've got some money for that. Oh, spooky. Some more candy boxes. And I see a pumpkin up on a lamp and a, a spider web back there in the corner. All right, well, this might be as much as the factory does right now. We might be moving on to our next stage of building already. Ah, creepy spider over in the corner. Why does everything have to be so creepy in Halloween Tycoon 2? Um, okay, so we're out, out of the front of my factory by pathway. Oh, I've got some uh, containers out front now too. Okay, that's nice looking. What do you call these things again? Connexes or something? People keep calling them really funny names. Uh, I can't jump up on top. Jump, a jump. I can't get up there. Can I get up there? Oh, oh, there we go. Come on, squirrel, climb. Come on, climb. Oh, he doesn't want to. So what else do we got here? Buy Fountain of Death for 100,000. Okay, what does that look like? <laughs> That's actually kind of pretty. Oh no, it's, it's kind of creepy. There's kind of creepy things down there. Why would why would this be like you're just starting a factory out? Why would this be a necessity to have a, a fountain of death in front? Um, clock tower one million, one million. How am I going to get one million? One million will take me at least three weeks. There's another thing over here by graveyard also for a million. So that's quite a bit to save up for. Let's jump back in here and see how much money we've accumulated since then. Can we even get close to a million yet? Well, we've got another 150,000. But I don't see anything yet. What about our second floor? Is there something on our second floor that I need to look for? A million seems like a big jump. Oh, okay, there's something way over in this corner. What is this thing? This is another, another conveyor. Oh my, are we gonna do everything over again, I wonder? We just might. Buy Skull Dropper, oh that's not creepy. Oh my goodness. What's it gonna drop? Is it gonna drop a skull? Oh, it drops a skull. And there it goes. So we've got a second floor now for Halloween Tycoon. Oh goodness. Uh, buy another Skull Dropper. And I'm out of cash already. So this is going to be another full setup over here. And look there, another buy Roblox, uh, Robux droppers. These, the first one was worth it. I don't know if this second one will be worth it. Can I jump in my fountain real quick? <laughs> I can. It's not a very uh, floaty fountain. So we have plenty to continue to build. Let's see how much those skulls have increased what we make. Uh, we're now at only 200,000. 
So I guess we're going to transport ourselves once again into the future so that we can quickly build this upper deck and see what it will look like. So hang on as we go into, into the, future. the future. Okay, a lot of time has passed and now here we are at the front of my factory, but first we are going to draw swords and fight. Who wants to take on a fight? Oh, oh boy. Amigo James is up high on the fountain. Oh, e. Ah, I'm going for Amigo James and a quick slice. And a, oh, Squirrel Girl, Stampede. Oh, <laughs> I took out Squirrel Girl Stampede. She's in the oh. Benelcha just took me out. Ouch. My pieces. My pieces. In parts. But look, I am lucky because I respawn close to home. Oh, but I have to go get another sword. Oh, quick, run back and get another sword. I'm going to use this conveyor belt as a quick, a quick run over here. Grab my weaponry. Got my boing spring and my knife slice, and I run back over here. Oh, oh, I switched them. I got my sword different. I was used to having sword as number one. All right. Oh, oh, there's Ben Ultra. He's back. Oh, there's Amigo James. Amigo James versus Squirrel Stampede. And, uh, oh. Ah, triumphant. Ah, <laughs> take that, James. Sorry, James, I feel bad now. Anyhow, where are we? Um, we're in front of the factory. Uh, let's check out, I was able to construct my first house. It's kind of um, not that great. Uh, it's a three bedroom house. So here's the first floor, the maid is dead. The second floor, the butler is dead. And the third floor, um, no one's dead. Um, just no lighting up there. So not the best place. Uh, let's check out what I have for money right now. The game is slowing down quite a bit at this point. Now it's going to take like a hundred hours just to build anything. Uh, I do have, look at there, about a million. Oh, oh Ben Ultra. Ben Ultra just stabbed me in the back. Ow. Oh, where did I spawn? Oh, all the way in front of town. Oh, I have to find my house now. Um, I think it's this one. He still has a sword. I'm a little worried, but um, he's going to let me finish this. So I should lock my door. That'll teach you. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, God. Teach you. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh. oh, please don't let me spawn in the middle of town. I just spawned in the middle of town. Oh, man. And this is my factory. Whew, I picked the right one. It gets a little tricky. All our factories look so similar. Anyhow, look at there. One million uh, dollars there to add up. I'm going to show everybody what's upstairs and we'll finish off the game here. So I have built some really, really creepy spider droppers now. Look at there. Ugh. Creepy. Now we've got spider droppers. That's just great. And skull droppers. Pretty much the same deal. Oh no, James is coming after me with a sword. He's mad. <laughs> oh man. He remembers what I did. I don't even have... <laughs> Oh, I don't even have, <laughs> I don't even have my sword. So now, once again, I have to race all the way back to my house. Uh, let's see here. Um, which one is it? Hang on. I'd say the bonus about all the walking around you do in this game is it gives you time to reload some more money. So it's not a bad thing uh, for all the travel. There's another chunk of cash. So let's build a couple more things. And then I think I have a second house to build. We'll check that out. And then we'll say uh, happy Halloween, everyone. Uh, okay, so I think I can build another spider dropper on that conveyor belt, maybe? By upgrader. Upgraders are really nice because they speed up the process. So 
there's a spider dropper right there I just made and I could build a second wall for a pretty good price that's not too expensive and a third wall we're almost enclosed now so look at there our second floor is pretty well protected now and uh, let's get some windows looking good now let's check out the house that I can build I don't want to spend too much more. I could get the carpet. That looks nice. Nice and, and uh, industrial. So we'll run up to the front of my house. There's my garage door. Any more money here? Oh, it's growing a bit. That was like a half a half a quarter of a million. Over to my fountain. And over here, I believe there's a second house. What does the second house look like? Ooh, that's a little better. Let's check this out, everyone. Run into my house and see what we have. It's kind of dark in here. Ah! Uh, so the butler is dead again. And this is this the kitchen? I don't know. Nope, oh, the kitchen's over here. Um, is there an upstairs to this place? How do we get upstairs? Um, it's, it's so dark in here, I can't see very well. I think that's it. Oh, wait. No? Yeah, that's... Oh, there's the stairs. I just have to turn left versus right, or right versus left. So this room up here is pretty dark and, and, and icky, too. There's a door over here. and Oh, the bathroom. Great. A dirty bathroom. <laughs> okay, so... Ah! <laughs> What's going on in this room? This room is creepy! Squirrel Girl stampedes a ghost. She's standing on a ghost. She's stuck in the corner. Someone's dead on the bed. Ugh, creepy house. How do I get out of here? I gotta get out of here. This house, I never want to go in my house again. I like my first house better. So there you go with that. And I believe there's a much larger mansion. I think there's a third house you build. Probably on that side, but that's gonna take a while. A clock tower for a million. Third house for a hundred for only 50 million? Uh, oh yeah, 50 million. Only 50 million. I thought, when I saw 50, I thought 50,000. Um, so there's plenty of other buildings to construct. And so this game is wildly building, 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 uh, but not too much else. But it was a fun Halloween building game. Let's see what else. Let's grab whatever I have left and do one more build here. Another half a million. Let's see what I can finish up. I might be able to build a third conveyor belt upstairs. So over here by stairs, so it's going to go up another floor even, maybe. Uh, another spider dropper, so we'll do that over there. So I've completed two rows, except for the doubler. Uh, more decorations, railing, speed coil, and grappling hook. Okay, so we have two new weapons to get. That's cool. So we've got that one and that one. What do they do? We'll finish off with that. So now I have... Oh, finally! The speed! Look at that! We've been wanting this the whole game. We can now wear this and speed up. Uh, this is very handy. Look at that. That is cool. And the grapple will also be fun, I imagine. Whoa! What did I just grapple onto? I grappled onto a skull thingy. Uh, let off! Let, let off! Oh, ah! oh, I just crashed into a wall! Let go, let go. How do you how do you let go of the grapple? There we go. So what can I grapple to finish this off with here? Uh, I like these two little extras. They're fun. Ben Ultra is having fun with the grapple over there. Let's try to grapple onto my house and I'll finish up there. So there's my first house. It's a perfect grapple spot. We'll play Batman here. Up to the top. Woo! And there we go. Oh, I didn't make it to the very top. I'm kind of stuck over here. Well, anyhow, thank you guys so much for watching another crazy tycoon builder game. This is Squirrel Stampede Gaming. We will see you next week for another adventure. Thanks for watching. Bye.